Now look at part two. For each question, choose the correct answer. You will hear two friends talking about free time activities. What does the man like doing? You do a lot of sport, don't you? Well, I've sort of got out of the habit of doing physical stuff. My sister and I used to play table tennis a lot when we were kids, which was great fun. I ought to do more, get out running or something. A couple of my close friends are into watching football. I enjoy getting together with them at one of our houses to see matches. It's more fun than on your own. You're a big reader, aren't you? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> That's something else I should probably do. Now listen again. You do a lot of sport, don't you? Well, I've sort of got out of the habit of doing physical stuff. My sister and I used to play table tennis a lot when we were kids, which was great fun. I ought to do more, get out running or something. A couple of my close friends are into watching football. I enjoy getting together with them at one of our houses to see matches. It's more fun than on your own. You're a big reader, aren't you? Yeah, I love it. <laughs> That's something else I should probably do. Nine. You will hear two friends talking about biking. How do they both feel about their next bike ride? Has your new bike arrived? Yeah. You know how much I'm into cycling, but I've never done fat biking before. I can't believe how big the tyres are. Well, you'll understand why when we're on the beach during our next ride. They're much better for riding on sand and rocks. It's a few kilometres long, so I hope you're feeling fit. I'm hoping I'll manage it, but I'm not sure I will. <laughs> I know what you mean. I haven't been out much recently because I hurt my ankle a while ago, but it'll be a new experience. Now listen again. Has your new bike arrived? Yeah, you know how much I'm into cycling, but I've never done fat biking before. I can't believe how big the tyres are. Well, you'll understand why when we're on the beach during our next ride. They're much better for riding on sand and rocks. It's a few kilometres long, so I hope you're feeling fit. I'm hoping I'll manage it, but I'm not sure I will. <laughs> I know what you mean. I haven't been out much recently because I hurt my ankle a while ago, but it'll be a new experience. Ten. You will hear two friends talking about growing up in the countryside. What did the woman like about it? Didn't you grow up in the countryside like me? Yeah, on a farm. We had cows and sheep. I didn't get involved with that. The animals used to be out in the fields and Dad would do all the feeding and stuff. I think he hoped I'd go into farming and was always telling me stuff about it. And my mum was always saying, go and get out into the fresh air. I preferred sitting at my window painting the scenery though. It was beautiful there. We lived on a farm too, but I don't want to be a farmer either. Now listen again. Didn't you grow up in the countryside like me? Yeah, on a farm. We had cows and sheep. I didn't get involved with that. The animals used to be out in the fields and Dad would do all the feeding and stuff. I think he hoped I'd go into farming and was always telling me stuff about it. And my mum was always saying, go and get out into the fresh air. I preferred sitting at my window painting the scenery though. It was beautiful there.
We lived on a farm too, but I don't want to be a farmer either. 11. You will hear two friends talking about a concert they have been to. What do they agree about? Brilliant concert. I love that band. Me too. I didn't think that was their most polished concert, though. The singer didn't reach all the high notes, which isn't like her. I suppose everyone has days where it doesn't go as well as it should. It was awesome, though. Those massive speakers made a big difference to the sound quality. Sure. I suppose you need them in a place like that. The hall's huge. I do prefer smaller venues which fit fewer people in, but it was still a good concert. Well, we'll have to go and see them again. 9. I suppose you need them in a place like that. The hall's huge. I do prefer smaller venues which fit fewer people in, but it was still a good concert. Well, we'll have to go and see them again. 12. You will hear two friends talking about some university work. Why is the man talking to his friend? That project's due in on Tuesday. How are you getting on with it? I'm almost done. I've still got to update the list of books I read, though. That takes ages. I never remember what you're supposed to put first, the writer's name or the book title. It depends which method you use. Anyway, Professor Johns likes us to be careful with our spelling and grammar, so make sure you look at both of these carefully. Right, I will. Do you still want to borrow my tablet, by the way? No, it's fine. My laptop's fixed now. 9. The writer's name or the book title? It depends which method you use. Anyway, Professor Johns likes us to be careful with our spelling and grammar, so make sure you look at both of these carefully. Right, I will. Do you still want to borrow my tablet, by the way? No, it's fine. My laptop's fixed now. 13. You will hear two colleagues talking about their work. How does the woman feel about her new job? So, are you enjoying your new job here? Yeah, there's a lot to learn. I expected that because I haven't done this kind of stuff before. And I think it'd be even more challenging if my manager wasn't so happy to answer my questions every five minutes. So, that's been good. That's good to hear. It can be hard at first. People are so busy with their own work that you don't always get the chance to get to know them. They're a nice group of people, though. If you come to the office party next week, you'll find out. OK, thanks. 14. Are you enjoying your new job here? Yeah, there's a lot to learn. I expected that because I haven't done this kind of stuff before. And I think it'd be even more challenging if my manager wasn't so happy to answer my questions every five minutes. So that's been good. That's good to hear. It can be hard at first. People are so busy with their own work that you don't always get the chance to get to know them. They're a nice group of people, though. If you come to the office party next week, you'll find out. 
OK, thanks. That is the end of part two.